Okay, introducing first, fighting out of the red corner. He's representing ETK. Ladies and gentlemen, please make some noise for Joshua. Here we are, Turf Wars 9 in Auckland, New Zealand. Tonight with Glad Rap, Channel Isaac Savage, and my verbal sparring partner, Benji. Welcome along tonight, mate. Thank you very much. Nice to be here. We've had, uh, what have we had, five high quality fights already? The first five are worth their money in themselves. We've still got another nine to go. I can't believe it. And Urban Sport certainly reigning up a rack of a terror tonight. A lot of wins. A lot of hometown crowd support, but this is an ETK fighter first coming out now. Joshua Wood, one on one on the red gloves. Cars there in the corner. And Craig Marshall Hughes as well. Nico go out here representing Urban Sport 2-0. The crowd are going to go crazy. This is a 3 by 2 and both boys coming in at 71 kilograms. Some would say ETK, the original gym versus ET ETK North in this bout. Well, what was formerly up until about a year or so ago, ETK North, sure, yeah. Greg Nesbitt, uh, previously one of Jason Suddy's uh, pad holders, while Jason was an active fighter. It certainly shows too when he's training those boys, he likes to give them a bit of heat as, as we get ready now for round number one. Big shot there from Nico. Starting off this round, beautiful kick too from Nico again in the blue gloves and red shorts. Southpaw Orthodox, Josh the Southpaw from ETK. Joshua Wood there in the red gloves, red shorts as well with no flame, just saying ETK there in the middle. Nice little feints there. He's taken the heat well there from Nico, who started off very, very strong in that opening round, Benji. Both boys looking very composed. Only their third fight. Nico 2-0, hoping to go to 3-0. If Joshua doesn't have too much to do with it now, coming forward. Now, a few shots already landed there of the left, uh, right body uh, rib cage there of Joshua Wood. Beautiful kick again there from Joshua Wood to the ribcage there of Nico. Nice body shot straight down the middle from Josh. Evading as well. What I'm loving about these two fighters too, they're both the same height, both have got similar striking styles. So it is a war of attrition here as we get uh, one minute down into the first round. Beautiful step up punch right through the middle there from Joshua Wood. Josh looks to be gaining the advantage here. Nice little check there. Just caught it on time. Didn't manage to get that one a little bit low. Got that one a little, a little too middle there. It seems too as it, every fight goes on, we see the skill level skip up a hop. Definitely. It's definitely, uh, definitely a step up again. From Looping the right. Fights. Right hook there missing from Nico. Joshua did really well to get out of the way of that one. And again, Josh evading quite well in general. Nice catch and sweep. Beautiful. Beautiful catch and sweep. Just as we talk about experience levels too, 
a more experienced fighter will capitalise on catching that kick. End of round one. And that's when you know it's a good round, when you don't even know it's, uh, Didn't even it's over. It <laughs> Another close one, but I'm biased. So I'm going to give Josh the edge in that one. Well, I'm not going to say too much. I did love the work from both fighters. Joshua, certainly the busier and landing cleaner of the two. And as we said before, ETK against Urban Sport. Nico definitely landed some as well. And if this is anything to come by, fight number six at the skill level of this, what is it going to be like as we reach the top three, Benji? Three, three New Zealand title fights. One of them a pro, pro Muay Thai fight, uh, title fight. Sorry. So this is impressive uh, already with these guys that are only in their third fight. So I can't we imagine what Cruchan and uh, Kane Codlin is going to be like. It was a get ready now for round number two. Tony Angelo calling all the action tonight. Round two. Nico there in the blue gloves. Joshua out of ETK in the red. Nico starting off like a wild very man again. Very aggressive. Probably had a couple of choice words from uh, Greg Nisbet. Beautiful spinning back kick there. Didn't quite land flush. Nico starts off strong, but as the round goes into the latter part, Joshua seems to come forward. We'll see if it plays out this time around again in round two. Beautiful teep and right uh, left kick there from Joshua Wood. Just as he teeped there, he got struck in the head from Nico. It's tick for tack right now, Benji. This is a very equal first, uh, second round. Second round, very close so far, definitely. No one really wants to go backwards. Having turns. Oh, nice, nice combo there. Switching up, going low, fainting. He's doing all the right moves tonight, Joshua Wood from ETK. Getting in the way out of getting out the way there of Nico's quick. He's showing really good evasion. Nice inside thigh kick there from Joshua Wood. Nice check from Nico. Joshua Wood certainly taking it to the urban sport fighter tonight. It's brilliant to see Blake faints and then plants. He really throws down when he comes forward with those inside body hooks and head shots. Beautiful kick there to finish from Nico. Another busy round, Benji. Another very busy round from both of them. Very close. I can't help but be biased and go for Josh. <laughs> Greg Marshall, no stranger in the danger as well. Had a few fights of his own, and Cars, one of the head trainers there at ETK, under the tutelage of Jason Suddy, a walking legend. Yes, Carwin's been under Jason for I don't know how many years now, a long, long time. Helps helps Jason, uh, you know, with the overall running of the gym, and obviously helps get the fighters ready. And he's always in the corner. As you'll always see him at King in the Ring. Trying to get in the picture, but looking like he's not trying to get in the picture. <laughs> Greg Nisbet giving some words of advice for the third and final round as we get ready now. Nico there in the blue, Joshua Wood in the red. Nico starting off once Very again, impressive. relatively wild, rocking the head back down, Joshua Wood. Joshua Wood taking a few headshots now, more than he'd like to from Nico. Loving the enthusiasm and the energy that Nico brings tonight. Nice jabs there, and we haven't seen too many jabs tonight, have we? You know, a lot of fights we do see the jab, and now big right. Both both fighters and all fighters tonight are mostly, mostly firing leg kicks. 
and right left hooks to the head. No jabs. No jabs. No no setups. Just a lot of power. That's what we love about oh, this lovely sport. knee. Love how he powers up, and then he goes down low. Beautiful kick there again from Joshua. Yeah, very smart change in levels. Just as we talked about, no jabs. A nice double jab followed by a hook, teep, low leg kick from Joshua. He's following all the rules tonight, all the moves. Beautiful shot there from Nico. Nice right. Good sweep. Beautiful capitalization there of that, that catch and kick and sweep. The judges will be loving that. Beautiful work there from Joshua Wood. Double up again. He knew it hurt, so he took him again. Nice work here from Joshua Wood. High work rate and very accurate for the striking tonight. Once again, almost went for that sweep. Tried his best, but Nico too strong. What a round, what a fight, what a war, Benji. Another war, another close fight. You can see the rib cage there, absolutely battered of Nico. Those kicks certainly taking their damage, but I love the style of Nico. Always ready and willing to throw down. Yep, very tough. Always, always started off aggressive. Josh had his work cut out for him. Uh, at times too, I actually prefer a wild man over a composed striker. I just love the uh, the, the gamble. You know, any one shot can finish it all. It's fun to watch. Not for the not not for the fundamental people, but 